Welcome back to the Bench Press Diaries and in today's episode number 6 I will give you a short progress update of my current situation regarding the bench press and life in general. So right now I have returned from my two week vacation and I am on a consistent routine. So I will put here a graph and you can see that there are three weeks listed and regarding the workouts i am performing two workouts a week two full body workouts so you are seeing that i am performing a workout then taking two days off performing another workout and then taking three days off and i'm doing the soviet peaking system which lasts for six weeks so it's a program designed to increase your bench press and my goal is to bench press at least 100 kilograms as fast as possible. So like I have said right now, I am at last in a consistent routine. I have my own groove, so I'm slowly getting there in my routine. It always messes up my schedule when I'm traveling and when I'm away for like a couple of weeks. So I need a little bit more time to get back into the routine. So from the three weeks, if we are looking at weight, the first week the average weight was 84.5 kilograms, then the next week 85 kilograms, and the week after that 86 kilograms. So as you see the weight is increasing, so that's a good sign. Regarding the calories, I am eating 3800 calories a day, and in my previous video I have said that I wanted to test out the carnivore diet but I decided to discontinue the diet because after analyzing it for a bit I have came to the conclusion that it's just way too expensive for me at this particular moment if I would follow this diet when I optimize it I would maybe spend like 100 euros a week which is double the amount that I'm spending right now on a vegan diet so at the moment I'm following the vegan diet that I have shown you in a previous video and I'm spending for groceries 50 euros or less each week. Now the waist measurements they are fluctuating between 87 and 88 centimeters so the waist increased a bit also but anyways I don't care the main goal is to bench press at last these 100 kilograms so at this particular moment I don't care about my physique looks wise how I will be looking the main important thing is to increase strength no matter what it costs so I will be doing whatever it takes to achieve it let's talk now about the Soviet peaking program so I have completed three weeks right now I have another three weeks left and this program is structured in a light day and a heavy day and so far I have managed to hit all the numbers that are written in this program. At week number two, the heavy day, it was kind of a struggle to complete. The reps, I was not feeling that strong. For example, I had three sets of 80 kilograms by four repetitions. So it was very heavy this weight for me because I did came from my vacation so I needed time to adjust. So basically I have completed the three sets with 80 kilograms and four repetitions but I couldn't get a fifth repetition so that was pushing at my max already. And this week, the third week, I managed to do the two sets with 82 and a half kilograms for free relatively moderate or even easy the weight was feeling a little bit lighter so i guess i have gained my strength levels back and it will be interesting to see where i will end up so my main goal or my expectations would be to hit finally 100 kilograms for one repetition after finishing this program now in the previous episode number five one commentator did comment that I should try the UF powerlifter program so I have checked out the program did a quick glance of it and I have decided 
this will be the next program that I will be following. It is structured around percentages of your one rep max and I will train the bench press three times. So already the next program is set. So I am looking forward to it. Another update would be on my chin up program. I have now left only one workout and I will have once again completed a four week cycle. And here in the graph you can see I have marked some workout screen. Green means that I have completed the reps and sets with this weight and some workouts are marked yellow. That means I have completed the sets but on the last few sets I didn't manage to hit the rep number required. For example week 3 the second workout it says 5 sets by 5 repetitions. So for example I did on the 1st, 2nd and 3rd sets 5 repetitions but on the 4th set I only did 3 repetitions. So I had to rest a bit and perform the 2 repetitions to get to the number 5. And one thing that hindered me in this program was once again the vacation that I did take for 2 weeks. And also right now I am training only 2 times a week. So the program requires a frequency of 3 times a week. But I am only training 2 times. But that will soon change when I will be doing the UF powerlifter program. Then once again I will be doing the chin up program 3 times a week. And after I will finish this one last workout for the chin up program I will run it once again with 10 kilograms. And this time the goal is to complete all the sets and reps so that I have a green color for week 3 and 4. I don't see any reason now to increase the weight. So yeah, that's a quick update. Basically I'm still alive but I didn't produce any videos in the last few days or right now weeks because I need time to get back into the routine, my grind. But as the days will go on and on I will produce content on a more regular basis because right now I'm feeling that I'm back into the grind I have a set schedule and and to tell the truth it is not so motivating to create videos when your YouTube channel isn't progressing at the rate that you want Basically right now I have only 35 subscribers and I am struggling to increase this number. But it doesn't matter. The main thing is that you have to produce content on a regular basis. Give your best shot and with time the results will come. It's the same like with the bench press. You just analyze what things you must accomplish to achieve your goal. Benching 100 kilograms. And then you just follow the routine, the protocol. And sooner or later you will get there. And it's the same with the YouTube channel. The goal is 1000 subscribers as soon as possible. And I just must create videos on a regular basis. Give my best shot. And slowly I will get there. I don't have any other choice. If I will be performing the activities that are required to get there. I will get there. So that's it for today's video. After I will complete the Soviet peaking system in 3 weeks, I will make an update video where I have ended up. So I will test my 1 rep max. The last was 92.5 kilograms for 1 rep. And let's just have a little bit patience and we'll see if I will be hitting the 100 kilograms or will I miss it. So it will be interesting. So that's it for today. See you soon next time.